10 seconds remaining. 5 seconds remaining. Reserve time. Radiant Team Ban. Ten seconds remaining. Five seconds remaining. Reserve time. Dire Team's turn to ban. Ten seconds remaining. Five seconds left. Don't freeze up. Reserve time. Ten seconds remaining. Five seconds remaining. <laughs> Dire team's turn to pick. Ten seconds remaining. Five seconds remaining. Bad Rider! Radiant Team's turn to pick. Ten seconds remaining. Five seconds remaining. You're using up your reserve time. Good mother. Ten seconds remaining. Five seconds remaining.
30 seconds to battle. Fortune. Got it.
like Dyer fortified their structures. Dyer's middle tower is under attack!
Got it. Radiant structures are fortified. bottom tower. Not much good's happening to Radiant's bottom tower. Radiant's bottom tower is under attack! Radiant's bottom tower's got problems! They're beating on Dyer's top tower! have been snow fortified. Radiant's middle tower is under attack! Dark light! Radiant's middle tower has fallen. in Dyer's top tower? Radiant's bottom tower's got problems! Dyer's top tower is under attack. I guess Radiant fortified their structures. Radiant's bottom tower is under attack! Radiant's bottom tower has fallen. Killing spree! takes me! Double kill! Mega kill! Triple kill! Unstoppable! Ultra kill! Radiant's bottom tower's got problems! Not much good's happening to Radiant's bottom Dex. tower. Elenage! Radiant's bottom tower is no more. <laughs> Stop. Stop. Not 
not so fast. Radiant have fortified their structures. Radiant's middle tower shouldn't have to take this abuse. Are those cracks in Dyer's top tower? Dyer's top tower has fallen. Where did Radiant's middle tower go? under attack. Radiant's middle tower shouldn't have to take this abuse. Are those cracks in Dyer's top tower? Radiant's middle tower could use some help. Dyer's structures are fortified. Radiant's middle tower has fallen. Holy shit! Elenage! Radiant's middle barracks have fallen. Bottom tower is under attack. Zap. Not much good's happening to Radiant's bottom tower. Radiant's bottom tower has fallen. Radiant's bottom barracks are under attack. They're beating on Dyer's top tower. Radiant's bottom barracks have fallen. Is Elenage oh, going to let their bottom barracks fall? Dark light! Are those cracks in Dyer's top tower? Wicked sick! Elenage! Monster kill! They're attacking Radiant's bottom barracks. Dyer's top tower is under attack.
Look what they're doing to Radiant's middle barracks! Magnus actually. Magnus is not terrible here at all. A Magnus, especially with a Phantom Assassin, could dire could. teams turn to pain. Right, they're banning the Tinker. Tinker essentially kills everything and anything that Phantom Assassin is. So Banning the hero makes 100% sense. 10 seconds remaining. 5 seconds remaining. Reserve time. We got 42 viewers, boys. Answer to life, and as we know it, it's on this stream. I want to see a Magnus, okay? I think it actually works really well. Uh, it's a solve, it solves a couple problems, or it has gap closing, uh, stun, lockdown, DPS. Especially powering. And OD after he's stolen a little bit of int is hilarity. Also, Phantom Assassin or crit. Okay, that is. Turn to pick. Is that a 33 silencer? No, it's a 33 slaughter. Pablo rubric. Okay, silencer. Yeah. Ten seconds remaining. I would have loved to see an on silencer. How to do that? Five seconds remaining.
Reserve right. time. What is Boga CC gonna do Five right now? Remaining. Invoker. Fit. They didn't have a mid hero, so it works. I'm uh. Gonna have faith in Horde. I'm gonna have faith in Horde. I'm gonna have faith. I'm gonna believe that Horde can do this. It will actually sounds just pretty good against the Booker. And they're obviously gonna get a low sort to deal with him, but nonetheless, they do have a way to deal with it. Alright, so my bets are in. I think Horde takes this game. Five seconds remaining. Ah, oh, the Phantom Assassin though, that's such a weird pick. You haven't picked it. Game and then all of a sudden you take it Phantom Assassin. Alright, complimentary pause to start the Dota off, which we are totally good with at this point. This is a very late game. Oriented uh, thing. All right, mid game. You got a mid mid a late game versus a late game lineup. So, um, so you're gonna really gonna want, you're gonna want uh port to do as best as they can as fast as they can. Open up a uh, open up a gap and never let them close it. I think it was down to. Oh, uh, they're actually talking about stuff. Alright. The battle resumes. No one's the smoke coming out. Yeah, so we got an Ake, Ake Silencer, Pablo, uh, Rubric. 33 Slardar, uh, Gork on the Phantom Assassin, and Excalibur on the Owl Devourer. Meanwhile, we got an RNT on Centaur War Runner. We got uh, Man on the Invoker, Laxa on the Dazzle, Saw, Malone Droid, and Revo, Budge. Oh, we got an insta smoke actually. Not an insta smoke, they're actually going for blood. A bit of it. You see this? Oh, they're gonna try and bait it. They're gonna try and bait it. Yeah, 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 they're gonna try and bait someone. Walk up. Oh, they're gonna walk. Okay, they get the invoker. Pulling it back. There's a slow, the stun. Astral Prisoner goes on the punch of the first blood. Go to its caliber. Actually, big, the big target. Are they gonna be able to get Evo as well? Do they have a, a slow? Absolutely crush for one more right click and no he will deny himself. XP is there and they will share that Sunstrike together as a prize and quite a bit of that's not the most amount of XP ever, but Excalibur. Let's get moving. Gold. And this should I believe he's got a like a bottle or like shoes on the forty eight gold for this. Is that all first blood gives you? 148 gold. Alright, not bad. Oh, I guess yeah, it wasn't a solo kill. That's not nothing. He's got boots on the way. He's a happy boy. Okay, Pablo. <laughs> oh lord, the pressure starts and it does not stop. Done, pulled back. They have a national imprisonment, but they're gonna try and hold it for the last second. Yeah, Pablo's, uh, yeah, he's not gonna have another one. But the right clicks are definitely gonna be there. But it's not gonna have a one. one. Definitely gonna die for this, actually. Uh, forcing against this region is humanly possible. Uh, meanwhile, Ake versus RNT, which is got four intelligence right now. That's actually gonna hurt so much. Yeah, all right, they're starting to play these games seriously. Yeah, you can see they're, they're not fucking around like they were earlier. Uh, before three has a TP home. He's got a PMS poor man shield. Got a RNT. Seems in quite in trouble. Will the pullback will be there? Just doing as much damage as humanly possible, trying to get the last hits off, but ah, so close. 
shots. He will heal up. They will reset that lane. Meanwhile, in mid. D2 viewers? Bug jump? Excalibur will uh, start farming out this mid lane using Astral Uh I think, yeah, he will win this lane. Uh, Invoker will like eventually get more damage with or something, but at least do about that. Our boy uh, Netta is trying his best to stay in lane here, but defensive try lane, especially with a Pudge and a Dazzle, I mean... Looking that great. Yeah, the Pudge will just come in, I mean, just the, the, the threat of the Pudge is enough to set him scurrying. He actually think I need an Iron Talon. Okay, but they're doing the same to the Centaur. In fact, the Centaur is actually under quite a bit more pressure. Three. Excalibur finding point to be a dick. We'll put, oh, actually, the hook is there. Evo is uh, going to get Excalibur. What is he doing? He's trying to get out of there. Oh, the double damage is massive, and he will get a kill. We'll pick up a... Uh, really? <laughs> I'll just... But RNT is in the jungle, which is a big difference, because 33 is trying to stay in lane, actually, and that means he's going to get an XP boost. But, uh... Bone Druid and Dazzle will not be able to push the tower, but 33 is in trouble right now. He's slowed up. They've got the berries. Hey, the damage is so big. He's trying to get out of there. I think he's in trouble, but he's in trouble, actually. He, he needs to go to the jungle. There's so much he can achieve. Yeah, Rowe just sitting in the side shop just waiting for like a clean, clean uh, hook and he's dead. He's gonna level 3, but uh, what he's actually gonna do? Oh, he's gonna go. Ooh, the hook will just be short. 33 will get us. Oh, yeah, we'll just walk away. Try and go back. <laughs> no. Well, uh, for cool. Face no. off against RNT. Okay, just doing his best to pull. Uh, keep RNT under farmed. Uh, how's it work doing, guys? Level 4 almost, to uh, 3 and a half. that's pretty good. Uh, yeah, Excalibur and uh, Flow in the mid lane. Yeah, so far, once again, Horror leading in the CS department, but uh, for once, 33 is actually suffering. They managed to turn this, uh, what was it, Surefire. This is not going well for him at all. Uh, Centaur, he's beating Centaur in XP, but I doubt in net worth. Six less to the man's nine. Okay, though, it's getting quite a bit of farm. He's just like pulling and pulling consistently. Every two minutes on the dot, farming the entire thing. 4 3 shooting seconds, 1990. It's not 4 3, it's. I'm. My screen is 16 10. My screen is 16 10, and Twitch only expects 16 9 aspect ratio, and so that's what it looks like for you guys. It looks like 4 3. Uh, I'm gonna try and deal with that like by tomorrow, but uh, not much I can do about it right right, right this moment. Seems uh, actually Lone Druids quite a bit of farm. Very three is in trouble. I hope I see a good bear slash uh, Lone Druid son. Walk away. Yeah, so let's say we're gonna go for the what we now call the classic Lone Druid. All right, he'll get the heal off. Three, three trying to get out of there. As he humanly can. Just gotta be careful because I think this launcher is gonna kill him. Be able to. Doing his best to the next free range. We're gonna go on the invoker. Yeah, yes, he will die. Radiance middle tower is under attack. Right, we can see launcher at the top of the network follow very shortly, like 100 gold. Uh, the it's Excalibur and uh, Orc. <laughs> I'm circling an interesting turn to say the least. It's been a very quiet game. Uh, very different to the other open call games that we had today, which has literally just been like running at each other like by nine minutes. It's been a ridiculous lead for one of the teams, and this time it's uh, we're already leading by one uh, KGPM. Uh, not one GPM, sorry. A gold, but that's uh, not all that much. Farming away. Uh, I'm kind of. I, I understand why Ake is here, but I really think that he needs to be more active. He needs to be doing more with his time. Daxla. Gathering on bottom. 
arcade room onto the OD. Oh, <laughs> pulling the stunts on uh, Sloan Druid. He's been playing this for really, like out of the out of his fucking mind, to be honest, man. is enjoying his uh, mid-game prowess. His uh, early in prowess, actually. Uh, he's quite a way behind the OD, but he's had but he's had quite a bit of health. Volker, not so much so. Uh, Gork, I think he's working straight on the Desso. I mean, just all DPS. He's way towards his first, I think. Oh, ooh, smoke up. It's big. Are you going to go for the Invoker? Yeah. <laughs> So the Walker's gonna die again, and uh, hilarity will do. As uh, we see Pablo to be bait. Dagger is there. Let's walk. Pop ward. They're going deep for this one. Oh, they will pop the center war runner. Ultra will he die? Ooh, the tick. Is it gonna be there? The grave's gonna be last. Yeah, he's dead. Ooh, okay. Playing that like a beauty. Trouble. It seems to be a in trouble, but uh. Not enough. The slow is there actually. Excalibur doesn't have that much map, just won't waste it. Pudge will go down as well. This is all intelligence for Ake, and the more intelligence he has, he just will eventually become a core, just with the amount of right click damage he has. Uh, RNT though is going to enjoy his momentary silence to actually start farming towards that blink dagger. I'm sure he's uh, enjoying it very much so, but Midas complete on the OD. He's had quite a bit of help, but this Midas is beautifully timed, and just, yeah, what you can really do about that. 33 though. Has a uh, uh, best way to put it, 33 is as being a uh, wife as the Central War Runner. Which uh, sounds bad because it's International Women's Day. Happy International Win Women's Day, by the way. Uh, but they're both just like but beat down so hard in lane. Okay, I think they want to make a play here, but they, no, they don't have enough DPS. He just reset on the bear. That was a reset. That was a fuck up, actually. They can capitalize on that. The bear for two minutes. Lundra is actually really squishy. He's only got 800 HP and like no armor. If uh, he pop, puts his ult on him, he's gonna have negative armor actually. And Pablo, I think they have the damage to do it. Just there to get it. Oh no! Ooh, the TP by Mitsuza and Revo. There's Excalibur as well. Oh, the hook will whiff. That was in trouble. One more right click and he will go down. That's a great turnaround, actually. 33. Not beautifully. And he went around. Uh... Why, thank you. Or oh, return to his lane. Working on Vladimir's. Haha! <laughs> hey, what? Where's the lifesteal? Oh, level 15. Yeah, he doesn't want to wait for that. I get that. That makes sense. That makes sense. Alright, they're going to start pressuring. Caliber's got so much damage actually right now. The fat. Oh, why is Lundrid doing that? Okay. This is Lundrid. Thunder Strike. He almost ran into that. Excalibur he needs to be careful because they're actually chasing him down and he might go. I'll just stretch the power chest, but it won't be enough. He will die. Three killing spree going to the way of Dazzle. This is quite the game. I'm so happy this is the one that we're ending on tonight because, A, I am Stop. fucking tired. And on the other hand, this is such a good game, actually. I'm, not, I'm enjoying the fuck out of it. This is this is pro Dota. This is what we came here to watch, my friends. Dire Snow fortify their structures. Daxla. Right behind Law. This is kind of what their draft was around. The first two picks, kind of one standing after the other. They can't quite kill the Andre as fast as they want to. Uh, Gork is getting really good farm. He's gonna have the lad zone in a second, and then it's a uh, so time. I just complete on the invoker. I was meant to have this. It was very long ago. Our strike will go down and it will be enough to take on Gork. RNT is getting low, grave will be popped, but there's no uh damage there. That's quite a big kill going the way of uh Necroman. Need to uh, keep up the pace for Horde boys to win, but LOL running like the speed of light because his hero's not broken. He's going uh, Maelstrom, okay. What does he got on the courier? Please don't say it's a full dragon lance. What? Okay. Three, three. Yeah, they're giving him some space. This man needs a blink there to start doing things. He's only halfway towards it. Uh, Centaur Warrunner, though, on the other hand, is 
Quite a little bit way closer. Not all that much. Work, uh, 300 gold away. Oh, sorry. That was 200. 500 gold away from uh, his flats. I think we're taking more uh, passive. Oh, we got, he's about to hit level 6. Yeah, he's got it. 33 is going to. Oh, yeah, he's going to back out, actually. I think it's time for uh, once that blink there comes smoke reveal. But uh, four staff is almost complete on the on the OD, which is a uh, quite a big thing. All these positioning items coming up. So far, it seems to be a uh, net worth lead, just barely in the nickel horde. But 33, a lot of position could be problematic. Ooh, they, they're gonna find Lone Druid, and this is uh, quite the kill. They see this. Up oh, 33 is gonna go in. He's gonna get the crush. Negative armor. A global silence. He's running so fast. Central War Runner's ult is has been popped. As a matter of fact, and they're gonna heal. He won't die. That's a bummer. Central War, uh, War Stomp is down for 76 seconds. So there's time to capitalize on this. Plus, they cannot heal him to full. They can try. Oh no, they're gonna leave a now, but do they have any wards? All vision by 17. This should make my life easier. Gork is farming. That is Vlad done. I think it's, yeah, it's a uh, deso time. And then it's a uh, group up and push. Hello to all you beautiful viewers. How are you guys enjoying the stream? Seven people, holy shit. Watching in game, but jumping in here to push your numbers up. Love the stream. Yeah, man, thanks. I'm gonna fix the uh, gas pick ratio. Oh, the god, okay. But Pablo's got hooked up and just deleted by the dazzle. Yeah, it's the wrong way to deal with the. 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 Uh, aspect ratio thing. Gotta figure it out tonight. For now, let's just enjoy the Dodo boys. Okay, is, uh. around. Do you get more info? Okay. Ooh, if they get the ward and not. Almost the result of his death. Or staff complete on the day. It's pretty big. Um, why seeing Gork on a hero like um, they so pull back? Okay, they're gonna pop Centaur Stump, and okay, they will delete him. The hook is way too late. Next lane might actually die. Oh my God, he just TP's in. That's another death. Please, Dust, please, no, lol, okay, run back. All those Gucci boys. I forgot Phantom Assassin can do that, just jump in and uh, delete. Oh. Nice, yeah, boys. Yeah, do me a favor, if you guys are watching this in game, at least open it up on Twitch, so I like to see that there's like a general interest in this. You guys. Oh, it's farming up a storm, though. He's got his Maelstrom up. He's gonna go for a hurricane but next. That he didn't go hurricane bike first, and how he's just so squishy. Like, that's if the slaughter, yeah, he's got a blink now. If the slaughter blinks on him, like, he's just a dead man, actually. Okay, oh, the smoke. Excellent sees it. Pablo, they will pull him up. They're gonna try to do what they can, throwing everything they have. They don't want to. Yeah, he killed himself. Okay. Oh, actually, Global Silence is gonna go down. They don't have anything to go. This lone druid's dead. Can they get this smoke? Ooh, please crush. No, okay. It's something. Two for none. Uh, We'll take out the global silence, but it is definitely worth it. Four more int going the way of AK. And more farm in general. Time being bought. Because we have talked about this, but uh... We have talked about this, but it's super important to also... Remember that Horde are on a clock. Phantom Assassin is a Phantom Assassin and does peek out. Uh, quite soon actually. But it's not all that bad. It's, uh, it's not all bad. Alright. Booker's starting to get some light. Actually, he's getting really close to that Ags. Just a uh, thousand gold. Thousand. Three hundred gold away. What is uh, Netta's next item? Yeah, it's group and push time. It's time to take the tower. It's time to make this gold uh, gold lead more than just like a thousand. In the strong landing phase that they had, there's no reason they should uh, fall behind. But uh, then again, 
Does that have hell with the dumb one? Okay, that's actually really big. Alert ensues. We got a three man smoke on but Phantom Assassin. Might be caught out by this. Yeah, 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 they're gonna see it. Bork is out of position. There's a stomp. Double edge, hook back in. The sun strike is on top. And she will throw down to poker while here. But then there's the blink crush. Their central is trying to ult out. They will catch the pudge. Bowser's is gonna escape, but Pudge is going to die a horrific death. Actually, no, he's not. Oh, he survives. He gets the hammer. Just the hammer at least. Yeah. Oh my God, he popped. Oh, he dropped the hammer. He got nothing for it. It's like three minute cooldown. Oh, that is. That is heavy, man. Ah, it feels bad, man. There's not much you can do right there. Necroman. Reese. Probably sees him, but he doesn't want to die on it. No centaur stampede, so they really need to be more aggressive, like right now. Their global silences have not been on been stopping Spartan those. Tower. Okay, it seems like uh, Rebo is going to make a play on the Rubik. Or not, actually. Or you could just walk away like a little bitch, you know, that's what option. I was getting kind of low. Seeing that Centaur is invading. Not like the fact that, but Gork has a silencer behind him, so. Uh, he's living in the lane. Yeah, Pudge and, uh. Pudge and Centaur are enough to get a kill with the uh, Invoker Sun Strike on top. Yeah, the tower is gonna go. There's not much they can do. Actually, they seem to be making a move for it. Centaur will go down. Oh, we'll get the hill. They'll pop the global silence. Oh, they want the slow drift so badly. It will go down. There is no Centaur Stampede to follow it up though. It is not on cooldown. Oh, he pops the grape, but it's not that it's way too early. Okay, he's dead. Oh, man, don't talk. That is two down actually. More hits for. Okay. Oh, they want to go into Rush. They have a. They don't have Deso just yet, but they are getting close. And this Rush is just going to go all five of them inside. Are they really contest this? Does he have eggs? Yes, he does. Ooh. ooh, ooh. They're wasting time on the unimportant things. Alright, okay, EMP's there, blank stun onto the Phantom Assassin, all of his men is gone, so that's kind of big. Wow! Okay, those orbs just following. <laughs> holy, holy shit, if Oka's gonna go down too! Not just connecting those shots, Excalibur getting so much damage done, that hurricane fight, what a beautiful pick. You got a blink dagger on top on them now. Oh my god. It's caliber man. This man is just playing like a god right now. Oh holy shit, they got the slow druid again. There's no escape mechanism. Down again. It went from a very even game. Went from like just two engagements. Went beautifully in play of a uh, horde. Oh, that is amazing actually. These arcane orbs are doing so much damage. How much into the yeah, 36? That's just at 20. That's good, man. Yep, high ground time. They're so strong. Nice. Thondo nice. is in here in this here spirit. Yep. Oh, I was almost good. Right, they took the tier threes. It's time to remove a sh uh, at least a shrine, but I think the old talisman dropped. <laughs> Lol. 2,000 viewers in game and only the other stream is Swedish. I got 2,400 viewers in game? Are you kidding me? Wow, okay, shit, man. Alright, the smoke on smoke will break. There's an initiation onto the silencer. He's gonna lose most of HP. People will be defensively astral. Grave onto the dazzle. They're trying to chase him down. There's a stun. There's a global silence. And Booker will melt. He will die. Chasing some more. Pudge is gonna go down as well. The Dax is barely gonna get off. Two for none. Beautiful play, man. Excalibur and Horde showing that they are not here for no reason. What happened in the last game was a fluke. And they gotta go high ground and they want it bad. Hey, some 33, holy shit. Alright, this is this is the horde I was expecting to see all game. Like this is this is the professional team I was ho host hoping to see. What a beautiful game actually. 
Slow Druid Dazzle, which I thought would save them. This silence pig is just melting. <laughs> He's doing such great work, actually. <laughs> He's a slow fucker. Got, gotta get points where points are due. Yeah, D Ward, part of the enemy jungle, I just get out of there. Beautiful fucking play, man. They're beating on Dyer's top tower. X slow. ZC is on the back foot after a pretty decent laning stage. They managed to. Kind of lose it all, but Invoker's got just places to explode to. This game is by no means over. It's just not looking very good. They gave so much for the farm to Excalibur. And uh, this uh, PA ha doesn't have her BKB, so there's still time. The second this 10 second BKB comes out, issues will rise. And uh, that's when they need to start being careful. Invoker's going to try his best to uh, push. The travel was a mistake. I think he needs a uh, blink dagger so much more. Yeah, they're, they're gonna let him. They're gonna let him. They got death though. They got five man. They're just gonna go. They, they want a base race. And they are happy to oblige. Fire's top tower is under attack. Radiant you have to keep You don't care. The tower is gonna melt the second everyone's focusing on it. Yep. Tower is going down. Radiant's bottom tower is no more. Are you gonna sweep back? Used to be a misunderstanding of what the plan is. Pablo will punch his way away. Oh, the bear, he just missed it. He's gonna go straight for it. Um, just in general, because we've been focusing so much on the fights, the item progression, uh, puts travel eggs on the invoker, uh, Maelstrom Dragonlance on the lone Drew and his bear. Um, I don't think he's got any net worth on it, but uh, let's just check anyway. Does not. Uh, Pudge doesn't have much. Blink and uh, Crimson on the Centaur. Dazzle thing. Silence just got four staff held in the Dom. Rubik with his mana boost and Blink is actually quite the achievement. For that Ags next. Owl Devourer is just so fat right now. He's going for Ags. Fed of Assassin finishing that BKB. And you know, our boy uh, 33. Going for a BKB. That seems to be the last push. Uh, Excalibur's Aegis, though. I don't know how much longer it'll last for. There you go. Speak another double, and you shall appear. Proclaimed. Alright. Yeah, this game is not looking very good for. Uh... Actually, they are split pushing. They're gonna get another tier 2, possibly, so. It's not all bad. And circle back though. The shrine. The tier two will blink in. Excalibur is really far out actually. Necromant turned to a pig, but uh he looks to be in the problem. There's a couple silence. Excalibur doing as much damage as he humanly can. Just focusing down the center. He will oh hammer down two or down from the side of uh is he see? Looking for that invoker. Dazzle will go down on the side, but tornado is not enough and he will invoke oh, perish. Oh, him right click. Perish. The bus survives, the other side of the map. This is uh, not looking good, but any, any way, shape, or form for our boys. Uh, blue. Or blue ZC, anyway. Or dominating this game by all aspects. What was looking like actually such an even game is just turned into a bloodbath. 20k net worth almost. Like 15. Side of X. 60, 70k net worth. Hex on the fucking OD. This is uh, this is pessimistic at best. 33 just blinking in for the lulls. I'm just kidding. He's not really. He's uh, looking for targets, obviously. 2,700 viewers. Holy shit. Okay, there's a nice little stun. Yeah, Crimson affects buildings. Yeah, the weave is uh, is the weave gone yet? The weave is almost done. Yeah, they don't want to risk it. They're going to play this smart. They're going to take their time. don't want to risk it. So, Bugsy managed to scan out. Or, and that's a cool story, but... What exactly happened with that? 
I don't know what the horde are waiting for. I think maybe the next Aegis and then they're gonna end it. It's actually such a short, short spawn time. That's amazing. Game is not looking good by any means. Law needs so many more items. He's got a hurricane pipe, man. It's too little, too late, man. They have a solution. Lone Druid is squishy in the early game, and they are playing to that advantage. By God, with Blink Crush and Global Silence. Oh, okay. That was Ruby. okay. I was, I was in question. I'm sorry. Uh, I lost my shit. I thought I was like, that was a game losing misclick. If that was by Centaur, the game losing misclick, actually. Yeah, they're all farming up. They got a 10 second BKB on the uh, on the Slardar and on the uh, beautiful Venom Assassin. Because the only thing, <laughs> because the only thing Outworld Devourer is missing here is more intelligence. He's going Shivas. Hey. Oh well, you know you can't you can't blame him, man. Huh? So much intelligence. There's just intelligence to go around, man. Whatever. He doesn't steal momentarily. Science, science steals permanently. So you know, not a good, not a good game, not a good game to be on Bugazi's side of it. Okay, I don't know why he didn't go blink. He needs a positioning item, and he is just. Uh, I rush back up. I'm gonna go take this. Easy, easy. Uh, I'm assuming stuns will come down. This is gonna be one of the faster rushes in uh, Dota history. Okay, they're not all walking into the pit, so I lied. Sunstrike is there. Okay, Pace is waning, so everyone just walks in. Alright. Here we go. The coffin has been laid. Ord is standing over the grade of Bogazisi. The round of uh, 32 standing over the grave. All they need is just a little push. 33 popping is BKB. He's going in way too deep, actually. Come on, dude. What is he doing? Sunshine will land and he might be dead here. Yes, he will go down. That's a gem drop. They need to get this. We'll get it. That is, uh. So instead of nailing him into the coffin, they decided to buy them spare time. That's about a thousand gold. 1,300 gold swing. Just for that greedy. That was very greedy. That was very, very greedy. And I have to wait for the uh, for the slaughter to come back. What is it's here's the thing though. Why play? Ah, it's going so well. I was I was almost like a no fuck ups game from uh, 33. And that was, but I mean, I guess it's a judgment call, right? You're like, I can get him. There's no way, and then the entire team is behind him, which makes sense if you chase them out of their tier three. I mean, where else is their team gonna be in your jungle? Lol, no. They need the slaughter though. All right, here we go, boys. Seems to be the end of the game. Final group and push. Walker going down bottom. Oh, but child for 40 seconds. Actually, quite a bit. Actually, this tower is going to gone by the time he gets back. Excalibur, what are you doing, my dear friend? Oh, I see Shiva's. Ooh, they popped the ult. Should make my life easier. There's a 70 second window now where they can push without anyone to stop them. Radiant's top tower is under attack. Excellent. Shot them, make them super creeps. Radiant's top tower deserves just as much help as bottom. Yeah, this tower is melting. Radiant's top tower. They need to be a little bit calmer on the pedal. We got this game. Deep breath, light chill, Dota. Win. Weave up. What did he steal? Hoof stomp. Double world blink in. Dragon will go out, get a stun. All right, but the initiation onto this. Templar assassin, sorry, Phantom assassin, BKB up. Punches down, going for the. Sorry, Lone Druid, he's dead too. TNT being chased down. The grave will be there, save him momentarily, but then again, it's just momentarily. They will put him into an actual imprisonment, and that seems to be the end of it. He's gonna try and back out now. Excalibur, buyback on this to the Centaur. Meanwhile, Phantom Assassin focusing. 33 trying to buy some time. Blink in. Excalibur doing as much damage. Will pop the drop the hammer, get a triple kill to his name. Ball buybacks going out. They're trying to kill Excalibur. He still has Aegis though. 
Wait till down, man. I can't even kill the first time. Ultra kill to Excalibur Rampage. Goodbye, Max. Oh, Uncle GG will play Dark Call, and that is it, ladies and gentlemen. GG is called. Well played. Horde and move on to the best of 16. And I guess I will see you all tomorrow. If you enjoyed the stream, check out the Twitch. Follow me on Twitter. I want to do this thing more often. I'll see you in the next one.